looking at the spectral lines of elements with spectral apparatus of higher resolution, a small splitting of the spectral lines becomes visible. Since these split lines are very close together, Delta lambda is around 0.1 nanometers, or delta E is around a milli electron volt. The splitting is much smaller than the actual binding energies of some electron volt. Splitting is called fine structure of the atomic spectra. This phenomenon can be found with hydrogen as well as with alkali atoms, which are similar to hydrogen due to their one valence electron. The fine structure has its origin in the fact that in addition to the electrostatic attraction between the electron and the atomic nucleus, Potential energy is also contained in the interaction between the magnetic moment of the electron and its orbital motion around the nucleus. This is also known as spin-orbit coupling. In this experiment, the yellow spectral line of sodium is studied, which is a double line, also called sodium D-line. To display the sodium double line, the following setup is chosen. The light of a sodium lamp, yellow, is directed onto a split. Behind it there is an imaging lens and a Rowland rating of 14,438 lines per inch, that is 568 lines per millimeter. The Rowland rating is a reflective diffraction grating with the grating strokes engraved on the concave side of the spherical cap made of mirror metal. A camera is directed at this grating from the side, which records the diffraction image. It is placed approximately symmetrically to the slit and is located on the so-called Rowland circle. The Rowland circle has a radius of half the size of the spectral cap and is centered around the vertex of the grating. Due to the spherical shape of the Rowland grating, a sharp spectrum of light can be viewed directly on the grating without the need for further imaging systems. When looking at the diffraction image of sodium light at the grating, the sodium double line is already visible in the first order, but a much better resolution is obtained in the second order. The two split spectral lines have only a very small distance to each other. This phenomenon is also called doublet. The wavelengths of the two spectral lines are in the case of the sodium D line, lambda 1 half equals 589.5924 nanometers for the D1 line, and lambda 3 halves equals 588.9951 nanometers for the D2 line. The formation of the doublet is caused by the fine structure splitting of the electron binding energy. The reason for this is the spin orbit coupling and interaction of the magnetic field, which is generated by the orbiting of the electrons around the atomic nucleus with the intrinsic magnetic moment of the electrons. The former is linked to the orbital angular momentum of the electron, the latter to its spin angular momentum. From the spin S and the orbital angular momentum L, the total angular momentum J can be calculated according to J equals L plus S. The value of the total angular momentum depends on whether spin and orbital angular momentum are parallel or antiparallel to each other. The total angular momentum, quantum number j, is therefore calculated in the parallel case by j equals l plus one half, and in the antiparallel case by j equals l minus one half, where l stands for the orbital angular momentum quantum number. The spin orbit coupling energy grows fast with increasing nuclear charge number. For a comparatively light atom like sodium, the spin orbit interaction can be considered a slight disturbance. In this case, the fine structure splitting can be explained by the LS coupling. Instead of the individual angular momenta, the total orbital angular momentum capital L, the total angular momentum of spin capital S and the total angular momentum capital J are used. If the total orbital angular momentum L is larger than the total angular momentum of the electron S equals one half, that is L equals or is larger to S, as is the case with the 3p level of sodium with L equals one, the state is split into 2s plus one equals two states. Total angular momentum of these states can be calculated by the absolute value of L minus S and L plus S. Consequently, the fine structure splitting of the 3p level of sodium results in two states with the total angular momentum 1 half and 3 half respectively. The energy difference between these two states is delta E equals 0.0021 electron volts. When electrons pass from the two states to the 3s ground state, photons with slightly different wavelengths are emitted. 589.5924 nanometers for the D-line from the J equals one half state, or 588.9951 nanometers for the D2-line from the J equals three half state. Thus, a double line of sodium becomes visible. The study of the sodium double line illustrates that the magnetic field generated by internal dynamics in the atom, such as the orbiting of the nucleus by electrons, is sufficient to split the energy states. The reason for this is an additional potential energy due to spin-orbit coupling. In later experiments, the influences of external magnetic fields will also be examined more closely.